Welcome to Meditation Moments with Unity of Wilmington. I'm Reverend Nikki Golden. I'm going to invite you to get comfortable for a few minutes. You may want to close your eyes. You may hold them open. I'm going to hold my eyes open. I invite you to simply begin by taking a breath, allowing your breath to be part of your awareness of what's happening in this moment. Allowing yourself to notice, are you breathing in and out smoothly? Is there a glitchiness in your breath? Is there a place where it catches? Don't try to change it. Simply be aware of what is. Be aware of what is really happening with you in this moment. Be aware of your surroundings. Even if your eyes are closed, see if you can extend your awareness outward and feel what's around you. 360 degrees bringing your focus and your attention to what your experience is in this moment without making it right or wrong. It simply is. It is this moment. And as you bring your awareness into this moment, begin to notice is there any tension in your body? Is there any tightness? Notice the looseness and the flow of energy. Notice how easily you can move your shoulders or your neck. How is that for you in this moment? This is truly the only moment that we have. And as we learn to focus on this moment, we are focusing ourselves in the present moment. And as you notice what is, allow yourself to begin to just simply say to yourself how it is for me in this moment. And you can complete the sentence in your mind. This is how it is for me in this moment. And let yourself bring an awareness of this moment into your awareness. So you're being aware of your awareness. And can you generate love for this moment exactly as it is? It's a form of allowing, a form of surrendering, a form of letting go of what should be and allowing what is. Being present with this present moment and generating as much love as you can in this moment for how it is, for how you are. Look around in your mind's eye or if your eyes are open in the room you're in. What can you appreciate about this moment right now? I appreciate the connection I feel with you. I pre appreciate the connection I feel with the floor that I'm standing on. I appreciate the sound of the music that's behind me and under me. I appreciate the feel of the room and the lights that are on in this moment. I appreciate my capacity to stand here with you, to be present with you. And even though I cannot see you, even though I don't know your name, what I do know in my own awareness 
is that we are all spirit. And while we are unique expressions of spirit, we are truly one. We express that oneness in many ways. But I know that in your heart, when you bring your awareness to your heart, you'll have an experience. It will be unique to you, just as mine is unique to me. And yet we're both in the midst of an experience in this moment. We may be aware of this experience, and we may not. And yet, we're having an experience. We're living in what is. And as we rest in what is, as we settle into what is, we can find appreciation, even if, if that appreciation is as small as a grain of sand or a grain of rice. We can find it when we're willing to look for it. And as we look for it, as we find the smallest thing to appreciate, as we hold our attention in that energy of appreciation and we breathe into our heart space, we can allow that appreciation to simply expand and to grow, to rest in the awareness of this moment, to allow the appreciation of this moment to come forth within us and to unfold. Loving ourselves as much as we can in this moment exactly as it is. Opening our hearts, opening our minds to this moment exactly as it is. The consciousness that we are in in this moment. And from that consciousness to choose to choose appreciation, to choose love, to choose to see things as we are, because we see the world as we are. And if we notice something that we'd like to change, to rest our awareness on love about how it is, and then begin to see it how we would like it to be with gratitude with appreciation and with love to be willing to see things how we would like them to be to stand in the face of how we want it to call it forth in the field of possibilities by standing first in what is and secondly in what we intend and thirdly in gratitude for our intention for bringing forth the desires of our heart to appreciate that we have a desire that we have a want to appreciate that something is coming forth from within us that we would like to be different. Celebrating that from a place of surrendering to what is and then stepping forth into the appreciation of what we want as if it's already happened opening our hearts and opening our minds and opening our hearts to receiving, to being willing to love what is and to receive something different. Feeling the joy of that receiving, feeling the appreciation 
for our ability to use our imagination and knowing that as we stand in what we want with gratitude, as we continue to come back to what we want with gratitude, as we set that intention of what we want, as we hold that intention in gratitude and we're willing to stay with it day after day as if it's already happened, feeling the wholeness of it as if it's already happened, allowing the feeling of lack to flow away and to stand in gratitude as if it's already happened day after day until it feels like no big deal, as if it's already happened, and then seeing it happening, rejoicing in our awareness of how we have, step by step, brought our thoughts and our feelings together in a form of manifestation, holding in our consciousness what we truly want, and keeping our focus so clear. Something else comes into our mind, and we just let it float on by, holding our attention, holding our awareness on that intention and gratitude, holding our attention on our intention and gratitude. Breathing in and out, celebrating, rejoicing, and feeling the aliveness of our intention as if it's already happened. Take your time, whatever time you need, to allow that intention to reverberate through your body, to resonate, to harmonize with who and what you are in this moment with great thankfulness, appreciation, and gratitude. And then when you're ready, come back to this time, to this place, to this now moment, bringing your awareness with an open heart and an open mind, coming back differently because you have felt and experienced something different and rejoicing in the knowing that it is done. And so it is.